Hi everyone, it's George. I want to show you how to edit the subtitles on your YouTube videos, the ones that you upload. Uh, first of all, you go to youtube.com and once you're on youtube.com, click on your own picture or icon on the top right and then go to YouTube Studio. All right. So um, you have to first wait uh, at least a couple of hours, if not a day or two, before the transcripts or subtitles for your uploaded video are ready. So let's say it's been it's been at least a day and then you go to on the left hand side you go to videos and you uh, can either look and find the video here or you can use this top, top uh, search bar to find the title of your video and, and go there. So let's say I'm going to do this one. I go ahead and click on this and then on the left hand side I click on transcriptions. Now I uploaded this two days ago uh, so when I click on transcriptions I see that it was already published so I didn't do anything I just uploaded the video and this YouTube does all of this for you they automatically put um, a transcription based on their language recognition software and so um, if I want to edit the transcript or subtitles I'll say transcript subtitles or closed captions they're they're all, they're synonyms in, in this case so if I want to edit them um, I go here on the right hand side click on this uh, three dots and it says edit on classic studio because YouTube is still building out their YouTube studio software and I guess the transcript editing is still on the on the classic version of the software anyway I click on here and then it brings me to this screen and then what I do is I click on uh, edit on the top right okay I click edit and now I can go ahead and basically um, uh, edit anything that's kind of and I don't know why it jumps down to the very bottom of the very end of the video so I just click and scroll this to the very top and you know here's here's my tip on on um, editing transcripts for YouTube videos is that don't be perfectionistic about it uh, people when they view transcriptions they're not looking for grammatically correct things just go by so fast that they're just making sh they're just kind of reading the words very quickly and uh, they're probably they're often listening at the same time sometimes they're just reading but people don't expect gr grammatically perfect things like with correct punctuation like capital H instead of lowercase h people don't expect that so just give yourself a break and not don't don't try to co correct everything I just recommend correcting things that are particularly embarrassing so for example or particularly misleading so my name is spelled incorrectly here so I'm going to correct that to the correct spelling and that's helpful because people then know my name and that's really my brand so I'm, I want to make sure that's spelled correctly um, let's see here there's nothing else I'm really excited to have you here because I think from this course you're going to form hopefully at least a couple of collaborations with the other participants but at least you'll have the instructions so it's pretty pretty darn accurate i mean i i didn't do any editing and you know this has all been automatically generated you know maybe the structure to form collaborations with people outside this course as well da, 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 da. okay so basically it's all you know it, it, i imagine so this is what i would recommend that you do is just to quickly go through and and check for any obviously embarrassing words I mean sometimes there are typos and I don't even care I just keep going if it's if I feel like it's understandable you know understandable to the person who's just kind of reading quickly it's because all these words will go by quickly um, anyway so so that's how you do it and then once you're finished making the edits um, click on save changes on the top right and good so see subtitles published it says and so basically um, uh, that's it so these these are both published and that's this is one of the things that I'm I'm confused about um, let me see here English yeah no that's that's correct so I don't know why they have both of these I think I think they I think this one is the one that I just edited um, anyway both are published I think when people click on this they automatically see the one that I edited okay so with that I think that's all you need to uh, oh and then share a link to contribute to this video this is also a really cool feature where if you have a virtual assistant or you have a team or you have volunteers 
you can give them this link and they will be able to go into the same video to um, to make edits to the transcript or the subtitles. So I hope this helps and uh, yeah, uh, have fun, I guess, editing your videos or don't get don't get too perfectionistic about it. All right, take care.